Welcome back for my final daily report market analysis video with me, Richard Perry, market analyst at Handtech on Monday, the 10th of August. This gold chart, we've been looking at the signs of a possible correction for a, um, a number of days now. Um, negative divergences, let's go to the hourly chart where you see those negative divergences through the RSI. They really did weigh into that payrolls report. It started to slip back and then on the payrolls report, you saw a downside break and a com completion of a small top pattern. It was not a huge top pattern, but in immediately it went to the downside and moved, started breaking support levels. And um, we're sort of holding on to that breakdown really now. T uh, 2015 was that reaction low in the wake of the payrolls report on Friday. That has held today so far, but we're starting to see a more corrective configuration, certainly on the hourly chart. And um, it'll be interesting to see where the little technical rallies on an intraday basis now start to be sold into. On the daily chart, we've, throughout the, the, this morning's chart, there is a key theme, and that is where all these trend lines of the past two or three weeks have started to be either tested or broken. Um, many are being broken now and subsequently we're seeing the one on gold which hasn't yet decisively broken but friday's negative candle starting to look a little bit less positive on the hourly chart and um, possibility of a move into a corrective phase the gold bull run has been enormous and i think that there is certainly scope for a corrective move if you do see a move underneath 2015 which was friday's low that would certainly on a closing basis, that would be lower highs, lower lows forming. That would be in the beginnings of a new trending phase. And that trending phase could begin to build lower. So you'd start to look out for the, the support around 1980 of the breakout points. The support around 1940 to 1980 is this sort of consolidation area that we saw a couple of weeks ago. You could quite quickly see a retracement into that not a lot has to happen in order to get the market back into that sort of area. So I think that we are starting to see now the building blocks of this correction. It's not really set in yet, but it is starting to take hold. Now, 1930, uh, sorry, 2036 initial resistance line is holding, and we'll see that old support of 2048 now turns into new resistance. So it, could it be that the market starts to roll over and then starts to build correction to the downside? We are looking at the momentum indicators on the hourly chart and any failure to reclaim the old support level of 2048, I think will increase that corrective capacity. Um, and uh, as I said, that trigger point, 2015 support. So with that in mind, I wish you good luck in your trading today. Click here to subscribe to our analysis videos. Go to our website to sign up for our webinars and also click to watch Trader Talks, our videos that give you top trading ideas.